Malcolm Rich with Shoebox Athletics, and today I want to come and talk to you about the top five things that I would start my home gym with. Number one being the dumbbell. The dumbbell for a variety of reasons, but they're a great space saver. They don't take up a whole lot of time. Almost everything that you see here can fit in a corner of a garage or home, wherever you fit your workout equipment. They're great for unilateral work and building up foundational strength. Almost anything that you can do with a barbell, you can also do with a dumbbell, albeit just not as heavy. And lastly, they are still a great tool for getting fit for just general fitness purposes. Number two being a jump rope. Now, a jump rope is great for hand-eye coordination, as well as an additional cardio piece to running, burpees, or other high knee, high knee uh, situations where you're just adding a different element of cardio and a little bit of hand-eye coordination as well. Our third piece of equipment is a plyo box. Now there's different varieties of plyo boxes, soft ones, different sizes, wood ones. You can also make one yourself, but they're a great tool for explosiveness, as well as unilateral work such as step ups or using them for a variety of other exercises such as dips. My fourth piece of equipment that I would start home gym with is actually a pull up bar. Now, you see the racks behind me, don't need a big rack like that. There's also these wall units that come through that I actually prefer my, for my home gym. They look like this. They are a triangle and they have a little hole for the bar to go through. As you go, go into that, you bound the studs in your home. They're pretty inexpensive. They're a less expensive option to the full home rigs that you need. That come with some pros and cons, especially if you don't have a whole lot of space. And they're still great for working on your pull-ups, your upper back, as well as support some core work that we do. The fifth item that I would start with, out with a home gym with is actually an urge. There's different kinds of urge, whether it be a skier, a rower, or a biker, uh, basically meaning that it just has some resistance as you're pedaling or moving through it. I actually prefer the bike though, because it's a little lower impact, as well as if you have a rower, which is also low impact, if you're doing a lot of hinging motion with swings or uh, pulling from the ground, that repetitive motion that goes through a rower, it doesn't uh, take place on the bike as well. It's a great tool for working on your cardio and intervals and just if you're going to put some money into one piece of cardio equipment, I would go with the bike for this. These are my top five things that I would start a home gym with uh, for a variety of reasons. One, just as you can see here, they don't take up a whole lot of space. They can easily fit in a corner, like I said, of a house or uh, your garage. Uh, all the equipment here is you can do 100% of the workouts that we program here at our Shoebox Athletics online programming um, with just this equipment. And you can get extremely fit with just this. Again, it's not necessarily like you need a, a big set and a whole lot of equipment. You just need to have consistency, staying focused, and you need to have some resistance as you move through these workouts. This is what I would start with. Again, a dumbbell, a jump rope, a plyo box, a pull-up bar, whether you make one on your own, you buy one, or uh, you get a whole rig, and then your bike. As you build onto your home gym, you may want to consider adding a uh, set of barbells, slam balls, wall balls as well, but just these five things, is a great way to get you started and get about 90% of your fitness goals met just through this. Hopefully you're taking care and we'll see you next time.